Uh, told that there will be more, quite a lot of new models actually that will come up this month. White Light and Blue from April of last year and another one being Clean Military from November of last two years. I'll start with the military first. As the series name goes, the watch is literally clean from any design at all. It is purely just new band and bezel. The DW56 version comes in yellow and white and also black. The black version has white layer bottom band. The other three comes in G100 series model, which is not very common. This guy has more interesting color that is navy blue, dark, and khaki green, sort of like an olive green, and the all white version. That's pretty much it. Some prefer bright, some prefer dark, some prefer this digital display, and some prefer analog, and some just both, you know? Pick any color that you prefer since all of these are pretty cheap though. And I bet they are, will be even more affordable if you bought them at a used market. So that's probably where I'm gonna go look for this model at. Despite of being cheap, all these models are also fully matte finish, which will come in very handy if you are the type of guys who like to custom paint or design your watch. You know, I'm just saying. Next series is the white and light blue, all based on G Shock brand color, which is white. Unlike last year's release, this version comes with turquoise and lots more mint green accent in it, which is to me way more beautiful. The main motive of this colorway is to match with sportswear, which I believe they are referring to tennis sport, based on this photo that they placed on my Navi website. There are tennis shoes and tennis ball over there, so that's why I'm assuming it's for tennis sport. Do I play tennis? No. Do I like white watches? Yes. Will I buy this right away? The answer is no. That is because I am currently saving up for the Earthwatch G-Shock, of course, or the RC or the RCRC version because man, they are way, they are a lot of them and they are all so expensive. Sorry to break it down to you, I'm not that rich. Yeah, surprise, right? However, the real question is right now: Will you, will you grab any of this G-Shock? All up to you to decide, of course. All this will be released somewhere at the end of this month uh, in Japan, at least. So, I guess that's pretty much it, guys. That you need to know about this month's release. That's all that I have for you today. Leave a like, just leave a like, man, because it really motivates me. Alright, subscribe as well for more G Shock related contents like this in the future. Thank you, thank you very, very much for watching. This is G Shock High Fashion Channel, and um.